Uh, welcome back. As they say, it's all about networking, networking, and networking. <laughs> and that's what uh, Business and Brews is all about. And uh, we're going to tell you about this event that's coming up, uh, one coming up tomorrow that you can check out. We have Ben and David here to tell us more about it. Good to see you guys. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thanks so for having us. So Business and Brews, Business and Bourbon. <laughs> how did this idea come about, and how long have you guys been doing this? Uh, so my partner, um, uh, Stephen Piper, Piper Insurance Group started Business and Brews almost seven years ago here in the upstate mm -hmm. and uh, brought me in a few months later right after I moved up here and we've grown it from you know used to have 15 to 20 people a month and now we average about 160 165 wow. people a month for the brews event um, and it moves to a different venue every month different speaker every month and we launched our spinoff event Business and Bourbon back in April with Dave and the guys over at 6 and 20 and uh, we had a great turnout, about 120 people first time in. So that was a huge, yeah. great event for us. And so uh, we got to talking about doing it again. And so we're bringing it back uh, tomorrow night um, at 6 and 20. We've got a great speaker. Uh, we have Morgan Allen, who is the executive mm -hmm. director of Euphoria, Euphoria Festival. Yeah. And uh, so we're super excited to have her on board and, and really excited to be going back to the distillery. And cool. she's a fantastic person to, to hear speaking. Like, even if you, you know, don't think you can get something out of there. There's always, can, always something you can get out of meeting other people in the community and hearing yeah. a powerhouse like Morgan speak as well. Well, David, Absolutely. you are 6 and 20 Distillery. We are. We Tell are. us where you're located because this is coming up tomorrow night. We're right outside of downtown Greenville. We're at 556 Perry Avenue over in the village of West Greenville. What time? We're at the time is uh, 7. 515 to 715. And there's 5. no admission to come. No, it's, right? it's free admission and open to the public. Okay. Wow. Do you have to buy your brews or your bourbon? Yep. Well, Everybody's on their own tap. Yeah. I want to like yeah. make yeah. sure people know that they'll show up there and be like, "Wait, it's it's free free bourbon." And now you gotta you gotta pay for it and support a, a, a local company too. And, and David, it's such a cool thing that you guys are doing over six and twenty. I remember when you guys started. That's how old I am, I guess. But tell us a little bit about six and twenty and why this is something that you guys wanted to partner with. That's right. When Ben reached out to us, we were so excited. You know, if you have a distillery. The nature of your business is socializing, right? <laughs> Bring, bringing people together. When Ben said, hey, look, we've got something that's really interesting, we said, we can't pass it up. Thanks for including us. Yeah. Well, yeah. Ben, you're Cross Country Mortgage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I uh, made the move over to Cross Country in March of mm -hmm. this year, and uh, it's been great. So the transition has been awesome. We're growing into a lot of new markets. Mm -hmm. um, and because of that, we're actually, I'm getting to take business and brews and business and bourbon into some new markets. Yeah. We launched in Colorado and South Florida and Charleston already just in the last couple of months. And so uh, super excited. I was down in Charleston last week for our first business and brews event mm -hmm. there. And uh, back in June, we did um, uh, Miami and Denver. Well, who, whose wow. idea was this whole thing? Uh, well, like I said, I got to give some props to my friend Stephen <laughs> Piper, who's not here today, uh, Piper Insurance Group. Uh -huh. And uh, we have a third partner, Mike Giordano, with Williams Wealth Management. Uh, and the three of us run Business and Brews. Um, but they kind of let me go and do the out of state stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and they just focus on the upstate here. Um, Going to Colorado must be tough. Yeah, you know, Miami, Denver is such a terrible town. Long tough place to be. Uh, <laughs> so uh, yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> when we were out there uh, back in June, it was about you know 78 degrees and, and sunny, and uh, we had a great turnout there. Um, you know, first time in, we did about 55 people there, uh, about the same numbers down in South Florida, and we've got uh, two return dates in South Florida on the books and one for Denver already. Uh, probably will confirm another one for Denver in the next day or two. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, and we've um, we've got several commitments down in Charleston as well, and we're looking to go into North uh, Western North Carolina very soon. And That's it makes ne networking so accessible to people because a, a lot of events you go to, and you're, you're you know you have to network, but it's just like one of those old school like you know pull out your business card and you go through the thing. This yeah. is such a more exciting way to do it. Yeah, we're we're trying to make networking fun again. Yeah, you know, so David. One more time. Up. Tomorrow night is the night, and yes, tell sir. us your location, what time, and uh, uh, 5 p.m. Uh, we're at 556 Perry Avenue mm -hmm. in the village of West Greenville. Easy to find us in the Poe West uh, development. Yes, okay. really cool mm -hmm. space over there. Of course, that's tomorrow, uh, 6 and 20. Uh, and that speaker will be Euphoria Executive Director Morgan Allen. Then you guys have the 15, 15th as yep. well. So we're going to Clemson next week. Uh, Monday of next week, a week from today, we'll be at the new Kite Hill Brewery in Clemson at Patrick Square mm -hmm. uh, with new Clemson Athletic Director Graham Neff. So we're super excited about that. Uh, we did our first Clemson Business and Brews a year ago this month uh, with Dan Radakovich, who was the former athletic director yeah, there. Yeah. And uh, believe it or not, Dan was our first speaker that we booked 
in South Florida, uh, in Miami. We're going into Coral Gables October 25th, and he's going to be our speaker because he's the new athletic director at <laughs> University going of Miami. Worldwide. Um, yeah. we've, we've already had one down there. He was the first person we booked, but it, it was he couldn't do it till football season. So <laughs> we had one in June. We have another one in September down there, and then October we're, we're bringing him Well, good. Back. Thank awesome. you for coming. Yeah, Thank we you guys appreciate for that it. very much. Yes. We hope to see everybody tomorrow night and next Monday. All There's right, no buddy. beer or bourbon here, but we'll, here. well, I guess we have to go to the event. <laughs> you you got to come, come to the event to get it. Yeah. Awesome. Right. Thanks, guys.